right guys something a little bit different for you today some new content that maybe you may or may not like but like i said it's my channel i do things i like and that is going to be what we're showing you today so if you like it good if you don't maybe you got another video on my playlist that you might want to check out i don't know let's see guys so as you can see got a new mower <laughs> um, got the cub cadet it's the uh, ZT1 42 inch cut I just got a small residential yard needed a new mower my craftsman I just wasn't happy with it still have the craftsman but uh had some issues but uh, yeah figured I'd do a little bit of a mowing video show you guys uh, what mower I got tell you a little bit about the mower in case you're interested in buying a zero turn this is my first one and uh, we're gonna do a little cutting today on my yard and my neighbor's yard. So I'm gonna try to get some footage, first person view on the mower with the, the uh, Osmo and we'll set up the camera around. It's gonna be a little bit different of a video today. Um, once again, uh, we kind of do like manly stuff here. I hate to be that way, but we kind of do like man stuff here on the channel. And uh, yeah, I like to mow. It's like one of my favorite things to do. It's very therapeutic. Pop some earbuds in crank some tunes, cut some grass. So y'all stick with us, let's show you the mower and uh, see how it does on the yard. All right guys, so as you can tell, we got the Cub Cadet Ultima ZT1. It is a 42 inch cut, zero turn. This bad boy has a 22 horse cooler I am nothing but thrilled with this thing so far. Nothing but thrilled. Um, does great, as you guys can tell, I've got just shy of an acre lot here. Most of it being the house and the driveway, but also gonna be mowing the neighbor's yard here, Heath's yard. He likes his cut down pretty low. I'm gonna try to cut mine a little bit higher. I'm gonna try to gradually start stepping my grass up, but um, mower comes with some headlights on it. So you can do some ultimate night mowing if need be, if you're that kind of guy. Other than that, it's pretty self-explanatory. I really like how it's got this open frame on it. You can get to the motor. I've done done my braking oil change on this thing. As you can see here, it's got a nice little uh, hose here. Whenever it comes time to change your oil, you just throw you a pan under here, pop her loose. You can get to everything. Oil filters on this side. Get over here and change your oil filter. Got a, place for a cold beverage yeah pretty stoked about it i've had it for about a month now i wanted to get a good grasp of it if you've never used a zero turn definitely a learning curve i mean you've got to figure these out i've got some hills in my yard as you can see so i'm going to show you most of the time i go up and down the hills but i am getting to where i can mow side to side on them anyhow guys that is the ultima zt1 so uh let's just get right into some mowing footage i'm gonna try to do some voiceover stuff possibly and uh hope you guys enjoy it so stick with us once again if this isn't your type of content sorry i'm gonna try different things here on the channel i like things and things that i like i put on here and i like to mow it's just i might be crazy i like to mow so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna mow today thank you guys for tuning in
All right, guys, so as you can see, I've got a little bit of an incline right here. It's probably, probably 20 to 30 degree incline. I'm going to try to mow it side to side. That's the issue with the zero turn. Um, if those front casters get away from you and get pointed downhill, that's the direction you're going. Um, so we're going to try to mow it side to side because I'm learning how to do this. Uh, you can do it. You just got to be a little more precise. But we're going to try. If not, I may have to mow it up and down. So anyways, let's go. So that went okay. I got kind of got away from me on that end where it gets steep over there, but so far so good. Now I want to show you guys how this thing does uphill. So I've got a, a really steep hill. This is probably probably over 45, 50 degree incline. Uh, I can't mow it side to side, but I can show you what I do. So let's move over here. All right, I don't know if you guys can tell how steep this is, but check us out. Standing at the bottom of it, it's up over my head. And like I said, it's it's at least a 45, 50 degree angle, if not more. So let me show you guys how I attack this. I can get most of it, then I just weed eat the rest. So it's no big deal, but let's do it. There you go, easy peasy. You can see one little strip right at the top, and the only reason I didn't, I could have went on over the hill, but it just gets so far down in the dirt, and it just it eats it out of you. It already done that at some spots, but if you crest that hill, it just chops into the dirt and the mud. So, uh, this is a side yard. I don't really care if it looks awful, nice and pretty, but now we're just down to the front yard. Now, this is the most trickiest part. I got a very steep bank that leads down into the roadway, so uh, we're going to try to figure this out. Bear with me. I can mow it straight up and down, but we're gonna try to uh, we're gonna try to do something different today and try to mow it side to side. Maybe we might go up and down. All right, for the front yard, since there's all the shadows, I got a bunch of trees up in the front. I'm gonna do a first person view, put you guys on the uh, on the uh, control arm here, the mower. Hopefully, it's good footage. But uh, we're gonna attempt to go up and down the front yard. We'll see what we come up with.
All right, guys, there you go. That's the uh, the old Cub Cadet ZT1 42 inch cut. Does a wonderful job, as you guys seen in the hills here of Tennessee. Um, there's definitely a learning curve if you got any kind of banks, and there's not really, a, unless you're on the river bottom, there's not a flat spot in East Tennessee. Um, but yeah, let's show you guys what the yard looks like. We'll wrap this video up. So, as you can see here, here's the backyard. I'm going up. Let's get up here and we'll get a good view of it. If you guys are interested in this mower, I'm not going to go through all the specs and details. There's plenty of videos that'll tell you that. I just wanted to give you guys a real life mowing situation. I got quite a bit of hills and stuff, and once you get that learning curve down, it's pretty much shows you itself. So let's see here. So here's my very top of my backyard. As you can see, it's basically sloped all the way down in through here. I'm going out through here and look at look at how it cuts. So there's a there's a view from in the shadows. Here's this bank. As you can tell, it's actually pretty good incline. My house basically is almost to the top of this thing if you get down to ground level so it's a pretty good bank there but i got a bunch of crabgrass that's why i wanted to do this video we're going to do some more home improvement videos this fall we're going to reseed the yard and see if we can't have this puppy looking like a million bucks and then there you go there's from this angle it's a little dark let's, there you go down the side yard i got very little weed eating i got to do after i use this thing i touch up around the garage here touch up around the trees in that front bank let's go around through here here's this bank so as you guys can see it holds you level pretty good incline there and we went across to it didn't have a whole lot of trouble per se this one was the bank that I'm talking about so standing down here on flat ground I mean, you can see this thing's over six foot tall and it goes straight up but I just ride up it and back down right up and back down we'd eat that top little edge right there give you guys a view here so see here I mean that is a pretty good bank right there and then the front yard we'll go down and give you guys a view but the front yard has a huge bank in the front of it it's the most challenging i should say because if you come off of it too fast you got a road right in the way let's go down here and we'll get us view from across the road so there you go guys got some strapping going on I could hit it with a second pass and make it look better but shoot can't beat that anyways that's what I got for you guys today if you're looking for a ZT1 Cub Cadet your residential mowing your yard or maybe you know a couple yards i think it'll do what you needed to do i've got to get some uh, leaf blowing done just a little bit of weed eating and i'm gonna mow my neighbor's yard real quick but i appreciate you guys for joining us here on dale earnhardt drive and that's all i got be sure to subscribe like the video leave me a comment if you've got this mower or you're looking at getting this mower or you got any questions i'll do my best to answer them and without further ado, guys, I'm going to grab a drink and we're going to mow the neighbor's yard real quick. So y'all stay tuned and we'll see you on the next video. Peace.